Welcome to the Student Association for Foreign Affairs. I would like to present Lieutenant Colonel Anders Enström from the Swedish Navy. He will talk today about Sweden's participation in the EU Naval Anti-Piracy Operation Atalanta. Welcome. Thank you. Since when has the EU Operation Atalanta been working and in what ways has it contributed to the improvement of the situation with piracy off the coast of Somalia? The operation started on the 8th of December 2008 and it will be on uh, until the 13th of December 2009. I would say that the main effort is to contribute to humanitarian aid to the people of Somalia. Uh, does the Somali transitional federal government support in any way and aid the operations carried out by the EU uh, Atalanta operation? Yes, it does. Uh, I would like to say in particular that we have a special agreement with the transitional government of Somalia, federal government of Somalia. It provides us with a SOFA, which is a military technical term, status of force agreement. Other than that, I would like to say that uh, the operation is the other way around. It's support for Somalia rather than Somali support for us. Thank you. Does Atalanta collaborate with Combined Task Force 150 on combating piracy off the coast of Somalia? Yes, but uh, I would like to stress the difference in tasks between the two operations. Uh, the EU operation will combat uh, things that are in the way of humanitarian aid. It will support humanitarian aid, whilst the, the Task Force 150 will go directly for the pirates. Uh, what are the day-to-day -day, uh, functions of the amphibious corps? That's a very good question. Uh, the amphibious corps is a small part of the Swedish Navy. Other parts are, for instance, the submarines, the surface flotillas, and the, the mine clearing functions. Uh, the amphibious corps day-to-day -day functions have a role in the fact that the Sweden has 270 uh, miles of coast, or 2,700 kilometers of coast, and uh, our task is to defend that coastline. Uh, do you see a resolution to the problem of uh, piracy in Somalia somewhere in the near future? Uh, this is a very, very good question. The near future. I know that for a fact that the European Union, Union have committed itself with financial support to Somalia for a long time. And I know that they are trying to develop police, for instance. I can't say that I personally see a solution very soon, but I hope that there will be one. Thank you very much. This interview, as well as our other interviews, can be watched at www.utpost.org. Thank you.